Splunky 2, y'all. Oh, man. Came out of nowhere. Yep. What's up, Brad? Hi, Vinny. Hello, Matt Rory. Hi, Brad. I, I Vinny said this came out of nowhere. It did really feel like this game came like, like five years of development and then immediately had a release date like a month away when they released it, the release date. So it really seems like it's come along pretty quick compared to like the length of development. Oh, speak of the devil. Splunky on the moon. Ah, look at that egg. Why are you on the moon? What happens at the end of Splunky that you go to the moon? It's all back the moon. Look at that giant head in the background. I know, it's Who's crazy. That? Uh, the That's story, Olmec, you get, right? Yeah, as you go through the tutorial, they give you a bunch of pages. Telling, your parents like found out there might be Olmec on the moon, and they went up to explore, and then they left you behind. You're Anna, the daughter of them, and you have uh, followed them up to the moon to try to figure out where your parents are. That's like the same story as Splunky 1. <laughs> what that exactly sound? the same. I love that it sounds like a bong. It's Splunky 2. Uh, this game Very is dramatic. hard. This game's really hard. We're going to play some of it. Yeah. It's like I, don't think, I don't think like Rogue, Rogue Legacy 2 seems significantly harder than Rogue Legacy 1. This seems like a slight, slightly harder. Like I'm getting my groove in as I go. Yeah, you can see here. It's going great for me so far. Oh, man, dude. I think I've, I only, have so I've, I've only made it to 1-4 like twice, maybe three times out of 67 runs. I've got 47 runs and I've gone to 3-1. God damn it. Um, Should not have brought you onto the stream. Sorry. Rory's uh, like a, you're like a, you're very good at Splunky. I, wa I watch you play. The only thing I watch on Giant Bomb is Rory play Splunky. I, I joke about it, but I feel pretty good about my skills in Splunky. Like I'm, I'm pretty decent at it. This is a uh, adjustment period so far. The big adjustment here is this is only on PS4 for right now. Uh, so I'm getting used to the controller. I've never played Splunky on PS4. Um, and I have to switch to the D-pad because I don't like the analog stick on the DS4 controller as much, but it's uh, difficult. It's an upgrade in difficulty. It'll be frustrating to a lot of people. Uh, it's uh, been a lot of weird deaths so far, but um, a, a lot of okay. stuff we can talk about. It's a sloth. Are the characters smaller? Uh, I think it's about the same. I, th I think the view might be a little bit bigger, but so this is the main camp. You have a bunch of kind of villagers and you they have sleeping areas. I think this will all be built out as you play the game. It's all pretty bare bones at the moment for me too. Oh, you think they'll add stuff to this? I assume so. I mean, my my main camp is already ex uh, expanding. So, oh, yeah. Well, this is a new da. feature. Yeah. Did you have you tried the speedrun <laughs> trophy for the tutorial? No. That, man, I was like wasted too much time on that. You have to get through the tutorial in thirty seconds, but we'll worry about that later. So as I, as of the time of this stream, this game is not out yet, right? No, this is out in. Uh, well, I didn't check. It's out like tonight slash tomorrow. Fuck. Yeah. Here we go. And <laughs> Splunky. I'm just, I'm just gonna focus on playing the game. <laughs> uh, I noticed that. Uh, the... Let's take a do over <laughs> on that one. I noticed the uh, symbol is an infinity symbol as soon as you go in. I'm really curious if this game has like an infinite uh, mode or it can go on forever. Whoop. I'll say it right up here, up front, we're probably not going to... I haven't looked too far into the game beyond what I played today. If you're worried about spoilers and things like that, I I, can't, I don't know what I can tell you. I, I can tell you what happens in World 3-1, which some of you might consider a spoiler, but probably it's not going to be a huge one. But um, I haven't There's looked no at gravity. Wiki or, Yeah, I haven't looked at the wiki or anything like that, so I honestly don't know. Let's talk about that ghost, uh, curse jar real yeah, quick. Yeah, I was going to ask, should I... What do you think? Should I take it with me? Go ahead. Watch out below you, because there is a digger in there. Or uh, go for it. They, uh, they really, it, they really front loaded with a lot of new enemies. I haven't seen a lot of. Yep. Oh god! Oh, well, yep. there you go. That's the danger so, of carrying the ghost jar. <laughs> the curse jar will, uh, when it's smashed, it will summon a ghost into the level, no matter what, uh, how far along you are. Also, I've noticed that I got. Go ahead. Well, what oh. do you get for taking it to the exit? Nothing. Oh, the oh, ghost jar. I don't know. Oh, hold on. I haven't. I don't think I've gotten to the exit. Um, you can throw it at other things and have them be cursed, though, as well. But it will uh, always summon a ghost, it, it seems like. Um, but I did notice when I, I took longer than... Those guys are really tough. <laughs> Fucking thing! <laughs> um, Get out of here. No! I, I did... Yep. I did notice when I took over 2 minutes and 30 seconds, I didn't see a ghost that time. So I'm not sure if that mechanic has been totally shifted oh, to the jars or what. There's a kitty cat. All right. This one's a... Adorable. Time to get serious. <laughs> yeah. Wait, are you saying that you rate the cat over the dog? Uh, I like them all. There's a uh, hamster, too. Yes, I, I can appreciate watch that. Out, watch out for the spike trap. Yeah, I see. 
Throw the kitty down. Some of these dung beetles, you can't pick them up, can you? You can't, uh, but they, oh, you and can. I, oh, well, you can. They're like critters from the last game. Okay. Oh, it, yeah, I don't think they uh, never triggered uh, spike traps either. The, uh, oh. your lady, your girl will. She can take one hit. Another big important part of the uh, first world is uh, the nice. sideways spike traps are now. Oh, right shit. Here. Oh, boy. The sideways spike traps now only do uh, two damage instead of four, so they're much more survivable. They're like more of a. They have like a punching, uh, like a boxing glove on them instead of spikes. So um, that is a big. E a little bit of a change that makes it a little bit easier, but. Poor cat. I hate these. Brad, guys. Have you noticed that? These lizard have guys? you noticed that thing? Yeah, they're, oh, they're really tough. Have you noticed that things are taking a little more, more damage too? Like from the whip, a lot of things get stunned now instead of dying right mm, off the bat. Like these guys? Yeah. These guys, the cavemen, uh, the moles or whatever those things they are. Can all, the you diggers. can jump on them multiple times and they, they seem like they, they all take a, a slightly bit a bit more damage uh, this time around. Oh God. Oh jeez. Yep, there you go. Well, oh, the cat, Brad. <laughs> Damn it. Brad. These, not my fault. The gophers are really tough. Uh. You oh, can look see at that gopher. cat, though. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what was it thinking when better, it hit that spike? It's better like, not to discuss it. Okay. At least give the cat the ghost jar. Yeah, try taking the, the ghost, uh, the yeah, curse take jar it out. In. Oh, nope, nope. oh, fuck, I didn't notice. Nope. <laughs> God damn it. This cat's <sighs> cat. Okay. Uh, M Matt, you've played a lot of Splunky. Is this very similar, or is there enough different here to change up? Uh, as someone who probably knows the nuances of Flunky way more than I do, for oh my sure. God. Is it enough to change it? Uh, it's pretty much identical in terms of gameplay. You still have the whip, bombs. Uh, there are a lot of new items. Uh, I find that the physics are just a little bit different than the first game. I find like stopping on a dime is a little bit harder for me right now. Again, it's the PS4 controller I'm not super used to, but um, it feels... Oh, it is very, very similar. It's, it plays very mm -hmm. similarly, but a lot of the mechanics like... Um, you now have a choice of which world you go to at 1-4. You can pick the jungle or the volcano. Um, so you have that permanent choice. Uh, and there's a lot of that branching kind of pass. There are, the biggest thing from moment to moment is probably the cave system where you are going into little sub levels uh, on the levels. And they're like the Eye of Wajat is back, uh, but you have to find it in a cave or a... I forget the word for it. You can still find the key and you find the treasure chest and you get the eye of wood chat, but it's uh, hidden away, not in the level. It's, oh, there we go. I hate those guys. Those guys oh, will. Oh, oh. Yeah, they're tough. All right. This is the run. Yay. I'll Again. try to get some questions from chat as well. Um, ah. <laughs> is that a mouse? Uh, a that is a bad. Uh, that's a hamster, I believe. Some sort of non nondescript rodent. How do you get those Five chests? Do I have to bomb? You can, yeah, you that? can bomb them, but that's not really worth it. It's not just uh, just gold. No. I want to see the shopkeeper. Oh, we're yeah, I've, I've murdered a bunch of them already too. Really? Uh, it's still possible to do. I don't think I've pulled it off yet. Um, is that the uh, is that, is that the move? Get the shotgun, murder the shopkeeper. Is that yeah, the pro move? That's generally what I do. Uh, ooh, look at that little guy. I think you I'm, can walk through those, right? I think I'm screwed here unless I. You can walk, but you can't land on him. So hmm. I don't think you get him. You can bomb down. I find that bombing uh, is a little bit more lethal up here. Like this would normally be okay. Hey, it's still fine. That's good. But now you have to drop her to trigger the spike. Oh, you're right. That sucks. You can drop a, a rope if you want to. Cattle drop survive? a rope. Well, yeah, it'll take two two hits. The answer is yes. Yeah. That was on her. <laughs> Look how shocked she is. She wiggled loose. There we go. Ooh, Ooh, you're gonna, oh, it's the you same can, shopkeeper. You can pick up that shotgun and just mm. start blasting. Hmm. I don't think it's crossbow is pretty good too, but it only does one shot. Yeah, uh, machete. I haven't seen that yet. What about uh, spike shoes? Those are uh, that's last game, but is that a what is the, that a pro move? Yeah, but, what do the spike shoes do again? Uh, you can jump for more damage, and you don't. Uh, I believe you uh, on ice. You will not slide around. All right. Hmm. hmm. Uh, I kind of want to see what this machete's about. Okay. All right. Uh, it cuts through um, spider webs quicker. It oh. does more damage than the whip. Okay. You could get a free shotgun. You could by killing them. Ah, if you're bold. Wow. Look at that. It's oh, doable. I have this cat. And also you see the um, little prison cell below the shopkeeper. Uh, if you kill the shopkeeper, he, he drops a key and you can get into uh, into the prison cell and get some more treasure. And the other thing I've noticed will he just is start shooting immediately? You pick it up. He won't aggro you right away, but he will uh, start walking towards you. Just start blasting. Uh, <laughs> 
<laughs> How many it's, shots does he take? Uh, I, I think three or four for him. Probably three, I think, on the shopkeeper. Who is the guy next to the shopkeeper? Uh, the oh, the guy left. there, that's Yang. He's the turkey. Uh, oh, yeah, look at that. Wait, yeah, he's yeah. down there. Got to do, do some turkey wrangling here in a second. All right, yep. fine. All right, go for it. Oh, no. Oh, keep yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Keep it going. Hell yeah. You can get man. the key and go into the um into the little cell here. You can open it up, then go up and get the shotgun and come back. All right, either way. Oh, oh okay, yeah. This is all new. Oh, so you found a dude what? down here. What in the world? Is this guy being held yeah, prisoner? Yeah, yeah, he's uh he's is Wait, there a way to go that... left? No, I guess not. Shopkeeper is a monster. Isn't that the guy that threw you into the spikes, or was that a baby that threw you into the spikes that time? <laughs> Matt Rory. Uh, I got two shots. That was your helper before too. He's kind of like the generic helper. Uh, but he's <laughs> I, the AI for this seems smarter this time around. They still will die badly yes. in a lot of ways. So. <laughs> uh, <laughs> boom. Uh, so the oh, poor cat. yeah, watch out. Oh, no. oh, oh wait, wait, shit. Well, so oh, much three minutes now. It's three so minutes much, now. It's so not two minutes. Turkey wrangling. Well, I'll have to wait for the next time. Yep. Oh, what point? if you smash a spirit jar now? This going the wrong go. way. Where is it? Holy shit. I think it, yeah, you may have to get around him. I, don't, I think it must be the other way. Rope, 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 rope. No, it, oh, yep. oh, 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 yeah. oh, yeah. I left his jar. Oh. I wonder what happens if you break a cursor while the ghost is active. Ooh, that's a good question. Yeah. I wish I had thought Maybe it goes away. Oh, no, I'm wanted. Should I just get in there? Oh, yeah. Oh, no. I, that's going to be a lot more dangerous. You can try dropping a bomb down there if you want to, but um, it's going to take a good angle. There's a shield over there, too, which is interesting. But uh, you already have the shotgun. You probably don't need to worry about it. <laughs> Unless you want that ah! gift. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> okay. Yeah. You got to angle that bomb down. All right, then. Uh, Jake the Snake wants to know, does this feel faster than Splunky 1? I say it's about the same in yeah. terms of movement speed. You default uh, by default to your sprinting now. You have to hold down the button to... Uh, that was an option. Oh, you can go in that thing if you want to. What thing? There's a door over oh, there that, yeah, this, that... This is one of the, the new mechanics I have. You can go to the background and... Oh, yeah. yeah. And you can kind of jump up and, and explore a little bit. There is some stuff in these back rooms. This one only seems to give you a torch, so it's not the best thing ever, but... Oh, yep. what the hell just happened? Oh, did you it, throw it at the wall to bounce back and hit you? It's rude. <laughs> uh... There are a lot of these little uh, back pass passages kind of things that'll go up and down throughout the level. Um, there's like alternate paths through each level, but they do take a little time to go through. So now that you know that the ghost is only three minutes instead of 2.30, they have a little bit more time, but you don't have as much time to explore as you might like. Shit. Yeah, be careful. Yep. Oh, there she is. Uh, again, if you have the questions, uh, ask questions at the top of the chat screen. I will be trying to um, look over as we as we do this today. Um, I have a question, man, Rory. Yes. Is it is? Am I confused, or is this is this PlayStation and then PC and maybe Xbox at some point? Did it ever come out? Is it uh, oh, yeah. Sure. Um, they've said uh, PS4 first because they had uh, obviously a co-marketing kind of deal because all his blogs are on PlayStation. I think they probably kicked him some money. They haven't announced anything else, Switch, Xbox. Uh, they've only said Steam. I have a feeling it's guaranteed to come to everything, but I think probably their deal with Sony uh, prevents them from talking about it now. That's just my suspicion. I, I don't know that for sure. Yeah, okay. I would be shocked if this doesn't come to everything. I, I, I could be wrong on that. Let me know in chat if I am, but I haven't seen anything from any other platform. I really no want this Game on Pass Switch. day one. Yeah, I really want this on Switch myself. Crap, 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 crap. Have you tried arena mode yet? I don't think we've. I, I haven't looked into emotional multiplayer stuff yet. I've mostly been doing just uh, runs over and over again, trying to get. Uh, oh. Trying to just try to get as far as I can and survive and learn the new mechanics and stuff. But yeah, they, I had, they, had, so I haven't they had all the online stuff. Oh. Wow, that was stupid. Uh, they had all the online stuff disabled until like an hour or two ago. So, just haven't had much chance to try that stuff yet. Made it, might give it a roll. Should probably just cut my losses and go. Do we like it better than the first one? It's really tough to say at this point. It's very similar. Uh, I'll say that. Yeah. I'm glad they didn't change the formula way too much, but it also feels very similar to the first one. Yeah, so I feel like I need I to get further. Yes, I feel like I haven't seen enough new stuff to really say yet. Yeah. Mm. 
Matt, what do you hate about the first one? Like, what would you, what would you want to change? You know, the stuff I hate about the first one was when I first started out, I thought you should have more life, and I thought that you should be able to. Uh, uh, I, I, it's weird mechanical stuff. I thought you needed more bombs and more ropes. As I played more of it, I realized it was balanced pretty much perfectly for the. You can try it if you want to, buddy. Uh, yeah, there you go. Okay, it's a very quick lateral move yeah. here, and you're gonna anger Yang for sure. Yep. Oh shit. He has a crossbow. He's not that dangerous. Was he, he, can't... Oh, was he right underneath me? And He's over on the left. Nurse him. Remind me where to take this thing. You got to get to the exit. Oh, just the exit. Okay. Yeah, it's worth a lot more this time around. It's worth like twenty grand instead of five, I think, from the first game. So it's worth turkeys. try. Man, all these turkeys here. Oh, I should bring try it. You can try it. Wait. You got to tame it first. Just sit, sit on top of it for a bit. This one looks tame. Oh, yeah, just, just, just hang on for a second, like, oh. and you don't, don't jump. Eventually, it will oh, yeah, love you. That. Look at the hearts. Yeah, oh, yeah, look at that. You can take that with you, but you can also grab the uh, item first. You bring it over to the exit, and um, you don't have to get off, I don't think. I think you can still pick up stuff. Oh, yeah. So that's worth 20,000, I think. Oh, eight, only 8,000, huh? Oh. Uh, you can't pick up the turkeys unless they're stunned. Uh, the dude Yang, Yang over there wants you to bring back two turkeys, and he gives you like a small reward for it. Um, you, you have to tame them and drag them over. You might be able to sacrifice it to Kali if you look down. Turkey there is an altar. Was, turkey head was very good. Yeah, it does protect you from damage too, which is really nice. There's a key down uh -oh. there. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah. Nice. Oh boy. Uh, you might want to. Hmm. You can drop oh, a. I forgot the turkey can do this also. Oops. Yeah, it can jump up a little bit. You can do like a double jump on walls, and you can do this thing. Can, can the turkey land in spikes and you live? Uh, I don't sure. I don't know how Yoshi it gets, but I, I believe it does protect you from a lot of things. You can pick There's up that skull without getting off. Yeah, the key is going to be, if you want to try to get the eye of Wajat, you can get the key, but um, it's probably not necessary. Like, I don't I don't even know what the eye of Wajat does here yet. I assume it might get you to the merchant's. Uh, Wait, where's the key? It's on the left side of those spikes. Yeah, by the uh, opposite end of the oh, spirit. Shit. I missed that. Oh, oh hmm. Well, we can try it from this side. Uh, Matt, in the in the original Spelunky, did those arrows that are shooting out of the traps keep going after they hit something? Did they uh, penetrate or did they stop? They usually stopped, I believe. It's been a while, but I think they they stop and break if they hit uh, flesh. If they hit a wall, they'd be full. Um, they'd be full full. You can still pick them up and throw them, but if they a lot of times they're only like half uh, half arrows after Not they hit something. One? I don't think I've ever seen two in one run before. That was a bad place to go. Yep. Oh, damn it. No, watch out for this guy, too. <laughs> I don't know. These the... wall wall gopher things are really annoying because oh, they're they like, they just yeah, come out of nowhere. They can really. You can still rope on a. on a. No, you can't rope on a. No, I turkey. think I'm screwed. You won't climb. You can bomb down if you want to. Maybe, yeah. Okay. I'm just going to let you know, Brad. No stress, but one minute remaining. Oh. Hmm. Try falling and see if uh, the turkey... Oh, you, you can still fall. Right. Hell yeah. Uh, it, is it worth getting into the first one if you're new to Splunky? Watch I, out! Oh. I think these games are... Ah. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry, <laughs> It only hit the turkey. It only hit the turkey. Uh, oh, boy. That, that what is all that pack. stuff? What is that You know, stuff? what you could do is go up and get the skull and let it roll down, it, but it <gasps> wouldn't probably kill the... It probably wouldn't kill the shopkeeper. It might, it probably only... it might destroy all the items. Uh, it might destroy all the mm -hmm. items, yeah. I gotta find the place for this key first. Did you uh, see it? You have to rope up. I have not seen it yet. It's probably above you and to the left. Um, oh, uh, the, the, the ghosty oh, comes at a, three minutes. That was a bad call. Yes. That was a bad rope. Oh. <laughs> you might just want to escape. I mean, the eye of a shot is not going to be super useful. Oh, there it is. There it is. Will if you want to try it, go for it. Oh, man, you got three seconds. The uh, ghost is pretty slow. Oh boy! Will the ghost kill the shopkeeper? Uh, I don't think it really. Oh no. boy! There you go! Oh, <laughs> no. I thought I could get it. No. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, do you know if you hold A, A when you push start, you continue from the world you're on? That's a good tip. Um, Not a lot of people. About know, from where you've got to, is it the same type of different world thing like caves, jungle, ice? Uh, I think I mentioned that earlier, but at the end of 1-4, you get a choice between the jungles and a new world-type uh, volcano. 
which is uh, kind of a mixture of hell and a more industrial setting, like a factory kind of thing. I haven't gotten beyond that. I've gotten to 3-1, like I said. Um, and that is where my journey ended. 3-1 seems pretty far. That's pretty good. It's like halfway, good, right? Had a good run. I don't know. The thing is, I, I'll go ahead and say a minor spoiler, I suppose. If you really care about it, you might want to mute for like 10 seconds after the 3-2-1. Uh, Olmec is in 3-1. And he's, so he's he's got more of a mini boss this time, I think, than a full boss. But um, huh. so I think they are changing around the amount of levels. I, I would be not I'd be surprised if there weren't more than four this time. Um, but I haven't gotten that far. So. I did not kill what? the boss from the previous game. What's the um, what's the ice world in the first one? Which one is that? Three one? That's three. Three. The caves are oh, uh, the. Oh boy! Oh, I didn't even see that there. Holy crap. Um, oh, yeah. And then four is the temple, and then five is hell. So I suspect there's more than five this time. I don't know if I ever got past the ice. It's tough. It's I don't really think tough. I ever did either. I think that was as far as I also got. Right. The good thing is, uh, so there is still the lady who makes uh, shortcuts uh, in this one, and I've made the shortcut to, to the first the first shortcut you don't normally do that on a lot of like high-end spunky runs because you want to have more items and health and everything like that definitely get more bombs um but the shortcut goes to one four and it lets you immediately get a helper ai and then it lets you choose which of the worlds you want to go to so uh you kind of have a little more of our choice this time around god damn it. <laughs> So that's about as far as I've gotten. I'm not gonna. I I don't. The I can't really spoil much more than that because I'm looking the thing up. I'm sorry if that feels like a, a huge betrayal to anybody who didn't want to know that. But um, that's about as far as I've gotten. You fiend. Yeah, no. Traitor. No you... There's gonna be. There are already so many callbacks to the first game in this. Yeah. I, I would not be surprised at all for Yama to come back. Oh yeah, yeah. Like Olmec um, is in the intro. Like that's not. Yeah. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. Um, also, come on. He needs oh. to Spelunky. Yeah. He smashed me right away. He moves in a different. Like a different semi-different way and i didn't have any bombs since he's a shortcut and i just couldn't really do much um so that was it was kind of interesting to see ah. these spider webs also move up uh, i used to oh hey good nice that's bombs. bombs yeah that's a good pickup um it's gonna make it make it last right Ooh. here at the exit so. okay pick up a lot of money on that one but there we go. You got fifty five hundred. I like the spring shoes. Are those new? Yeah, go for it. Yeah, no, they're 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 in the first game. Oh. Climbing gloves too. Uh, Rogue Paul. Spring shoes have an, a minorly annoying visual effect. Ooh. I'm not sure I'm a fan it, of it. I kind of it looks kind of nice mm. to me. It definitely reminds. Do you turn bad. it off? I don't think so. Uh, there are a lot of options for stuff, especially HUD stuff, but I didn't see anything for like specific graphical effects. Oh, interesting. Yeah, there's a decent amount of customization here. Yeah, I don't uh, think you can. Trim Fandango. Maybe game, gameplay? Oh. Instant restart. Yeah, that's on the menu instead of having <laughs> to bomb yourself to death to get back in there. Probably <laughs> going to need that. <laughs> it's oh. really hard to select it by accident, so. Uh, Trim Fandango wants to know how the water tech is. That's one of the big things that has changed so far. If you blow up, I've noticed that especially in the uh, lava or uh, volcano world, the lava now is very fluid and will uh, kind of do the Terraria thing or the, what was that game that everybody loved that had fluid water tech? No, I didn't mean game. That. Fuck. Oh, pixel, man. pixel art? Pixel, oh, pixel junk? Screwed. No, it was something else, but at any rate, Lava will kind of conform to the area that it's in and, and spread out and actually persist pretty pretty lengthy amount of time. Probably don't need that. Warn me. Do um, I know you got a, you got ghost problems, but uh, when you do the rope, it has like a little charm, like a little. Oh boy, you were right there. Escape. Let's just escape. Uh, when you do the rope, there's like yeah. a little um little dongle, like a little like yeah. a little um dingle dongle on there. On the it top. has a little pet a little, on it. Um, a little charm. dog. I forget if they did this in the first game, but if you if you put a rope up and it hits lava on the bottom end, it'll burn all the way up to the dongle, and and that's all that remains on it. So it's so a lot of neat little graphical effects. It looks very similar Is to this... the first game, but it does the, look very similar. Yeah, the the effects on the uh, uh, stuff like the jetpack and lava is really where the bells and whistles have kind yes. of come in. So yeah, they're they're the art style is very similar, but the tech has definitely been upgraded. Look at, that, look at the, the the light sourcing on this. Like, I know. Stuff. It's that's, some good looking stuff. Like, ray traced. That's right. The um, oh, turkey. The, 
the the they added a bunch of stuff in over the course of time in Spunky. Is most of that stuff coming in like the challenges and uh, uh, so the daily challenges are already there. Yeah, decent um, amounts. Okay. Oh God! You didn't. <laughs> you're flashing there, but I don't think you got hurt. I can't. Oh. It's hard to tell. Oh, yeah, I think you're right. Yeah. Mm. The turkey does absorb some damage for you. Let me get this guy to Yang, but I don't know how to get there. Uh, was there was when you play multiplayer? I've only played local huh. multiplayer and Spunky mm -hmm. one. Oh, get your turkey on. When you played multiplayer, can you move the screen independently, or is it always the person with the flag? It follows. No, it's. I believe you can both have your own independent viewpoint now. But like I said, I haven't tried it. But uh, that's a big one for them. Oh, am I gonna get this turkey over there? Bomb, I guess. Yeah, it's probably not worth it. I mean, uh, unless you really want to. It takes a long time, right. and I don't find the rewards have been really. No, it's amazing. not that. Just from the standpoint of showing people stuff in the game. Sure. I mean, that's a big one, though. There are writable creatures now. I'm sure that's going to come into play a bunch more later on. Shit. Oh God. Ooh. Oh my God. <laughs> no, no, no. He's okay. I well, found my third turkey. Uh, yeah, so I played with Will Smith on a stream not too long ago using couch play. Um, and it was, it, those first game co-op always felt a little bit tagged in or uh, kind of uh, thrown together, especially with, you know, not being online. You have to uh, kind, of, kind of stay very close together, uh, all that kind of stuff. I think it's going to be a lot more fun this time around. Looking forward to trying it out. Yeah, I tried doing some... Um some Splunky co-op with my kids and that's um, that's an exercise and frustration you don't need to do. That's, <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, like, it's tough. Oh, it's like, it's oh. hard with people you uh, trust to play video games and like if you're teaching a six-year-old how to play Splunky, that could be... Uh, See, the rewards for all that is are generally not it's the best. Like, you got a parachute. Like an item, yeah. Yeah, it's kind of could be probably could be anything. Probably maybe it's a little bit better than a, a regular chest, but uh, like a parachute is not worth doing all that time also, for. Also, uh, take it from me. Don't let this guy see a dead turkey. Yeah, he, he does not like he that. Does not like it at all. Oh, it's ghost uh, time. Oh shit. So there are apparently twelve sons of Yang in this game. So I have a feeling there's going to be a lot of weird mini games like that. Huh. Wait, they're not all turkey dudes. I don't believe so. I don't know. I think they all have their different things from the from the um, notepad kind of thing that you get. Oh, hey, we're on one four. You're gonna do this, Brad. That's right. This is my time to shine. So one four pretty much always has this boss named the Quill Bear, uh, which I assume you'll get to in a second here. He's a pretty not super easy as you might Aww. expect, but more of a mini boss than a boss boss. But I don't like the sound of that. Is that what the uh, the drawings on the wall are? Yes, he is below you to the right. Shit. If you want to check him out. Oh boy. Um, down in that big chamber. You don't have to beat him. You can bomb your way down one of the side passages, but if you want to show people a little something, he's fun to he's fun to watch. <laughs> he's not super difficult, but he's used to a do shotgun for you. Uh you get an easier path down. <gasps> you could just go through here. I do have all these bombs. You could. But there's a Keeper in there, isn't there? Or is that the exit? Nope. Uh, no, it just gives you down to a little side passage. Oh. Can you steal turkeys once you give them to him? I don't know. I've never tried. I haven't really fooled around with the turkeys too much. I fooled around with the turkey. Get the fuck out of here. Oh. Oh, weird. This is a bigger one. I've never seen this before. Yeah, luckily they don't have many enemies in them from what I've seen. Uh, just kind of a quick passageway. I really hate dark levels. I have run into a dark level. Uh, it looks like there's a bat there, though. Oh, wrong? oh God, no, I'm getting nervous. It's just a bat. <coughs> it's just a bat. Okay. Oh, snails. Oh, What's up with the snails? Uh, they will let you know which way you're going. That means you're going towards the uh, uh, volcanic uh, exit. If you go all the way to the left, you will find what? the exit to the jungle. And oh, you'll also oh. find How a do you know that? So you're actually making your choice here by which door you go? Yeah. Huh. Because uh, I did it a bunch. I mean, <laughs> well, look at me. I'm Matt Rory. I finished World 1 a whole bunch of times. <laughs> I write well, game I guides. I know what I'm talking about. The crazy thing is that. Um, in order to get the shortcut built, you have to have three different items. First is like 2,000 gold, 
then I think it's like a bomb, and then I think it's like ten thousand or something like that. So it takes a while <gasps> to uh, unlock the shortcut. It's a, a new character you can unlock. Go oh. in and hit it. Oh, oh, like a skin. Wait. Yeah, go to help. Right. I remember that guy. Yeah. And now you can choose that skin when you when you play. At least I believe so. Yeah, he'll also show up in your in your camp. Oh, this is blocked. Huh. Uh, that's where you spawn if you do the shortcut from the main oh, camp. Oh, okay. Well, the boss isn't here. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, he's above you. you. You avoided him. Nice. Good job, bro. Yeah, I should probably just move on. Sorry, yeah, you'll, you'll see him uh, that's, The left one is jungle. Oh, shit. I'm not going that way. <laughs> Try the uh, volcanic one. It's it's new. Yeah, I want to see those fluid dynamics. Yeah. Be careful <laughs> about lava here. Ah. Hmm. I love shortcuts. That's probably worth doing. Yeah. Definitely. I mean, as I said, you're not going to do a lot of shortcut work later on when you're really good and can do more of the game, but uh, I I found it really handy to just have that shortcut there and so I can warp right here and try the new worlds out. Yeah. Oh, so if you got to learn you, the world, right? If you get this, be prepared oh, to run. No. Oh my god, what is he <laughs> doing? <laughs> he fucked fucking asshole. He it. <laughs> Holy shit. The guy was the guy was making a command decision there. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, that's good. That was uh, I didn't, that's you know. Funny. <laughs> uh, oh, oh man! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's still, is, that, is that the Leroy Jenkins meme yeah, yeah. still play? Or is that too old? Is that a? Uh, he's still. That's only sixteen years old now. Guy really. Uh, oh, had a, he had a plan and he executed on it. Uh, <laughs> they are unpredictable. From the thing is, you can do is just pick up your your aid and like carry him around, so you get less uh, of the. Less of the. You're not gonna have the shortcut yet, unfortunately. Oh, you have to keep. Oh, that's right. You have to keep donating, right? Yeah, you have to do three things for her now. <laughs> Man. Man. Yeah. Oh boy, that was. Again, this is a, the infinity symbol. I'm really curious if this implies something. Yeah, I, I was. I, I was thinking the same thing actually. Oh, wait, did the other uh, did Spunky one not like loop back around to start over? No, it had a, had a hard ending in five four. Oh. I, yeah, I just assumed you just kind of started back at level one one. That's usually what I did, um, <laughs> but uh, I, I'm curious. I, I'm just pure speculation. Uh, I assume it means something, but I don't know uh, what yet. Just looks cool. Yeah. Oh. So people live down here. Like those uh, those guys just kind of live there on the moon. Yeah. Cavemen the, on the moon. Cavemen on the moon. Hmm. Curse that snake. You can. Or you can curse the uh, dog, too. I've done that. Oh, these guys are annoying. Oh, don't break the thing. Oh, you ass. Oh, he got oh, cursed, got man. So if you get cursed, you die, I think, within like 15, 20 seconds. I'm not sure what it does to enemies. Pardon me. Richard Butts wants to know, have you heard anything about UFO 50? Uh, the last thing we heard about it was that Derek, you was focusing on this instead of UFO 50. And uh, I assume he's going to. Oh, so if you want to do the freeze ray pack, you can. Freeze ray trick. All you do is pick up the freeze ray, walk a little bit to the left, and then uh, freeze the uh, merchant and jump on him. And he's dead. Is that a Splunky 1 thing? It's super easy. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yes, yeah, it's, 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 it's okay. doable. Just pick it up without buying it, walk a little bit to the left, turn around and, and zap is him, that, then jump is, on him. Is that just so you don't get frozen yourself? Uh, you can't freeze yourself with it, but oh. he'll die immediately. Oh, you, went you went too far, you went too far. You went too far. I didn't know <laughs> how far was a little bit. <laughs> Sorry, I should have been more explicit. Shit. You have to be very too far. <laughs> uh. oh, that's the one I did all the time. There's a more tricks for getting... Um, it's a really annoying placement for that, that damsel. Um, there are tricks for, like putting up a, a rope right outside the thing and throwing a bomb in. I've actually noticed that some items can now be destroyed entirely. Like I've blown up jetpacks and stuff before with bombs, which I believe is new. Um, like if stuff drops in lava, it was always going to die. But it feels like they're a little bit more um, destructible this time around. So you have to be a little Matt, more careful. What, what is your, um, by the end of one... Four, going into two one, Splunky one. What is your perfect um, 
Oh god. Oh, like just... outfitting. Like what is what is your what's your kit? Ideally you'll have a shotgun as soon as possible. Ideally you'll get a uh uh jetpack. Uh those two are really the keys for um being prepared for the rest of the game. Those are pretty not it's pretty easy to get a shotgun if you know how to deal with the shopkeepers. The jetpacks are always a lot more rare. Um but ideally you don't want to lose too much health. Um you want to get more bombs from a shop if you can. Uh, bombs and uh, health are really the two big currencies in Splunky. Um, but there's a lot of new so items rope? here. Like rope is rope is definitely needed, uh, especially if you don't get a shot, uh, jetpack. Um, but you can do things like uh, the the uh, grips, uh, the climbing gloves, kind of make ropes less necessary. Um, so uh, bombs are definitely more needed than um, than ropes yeah. the way I play. There you go. Oh, oh, oh these guys oh, suck. Oh, ass. man. Well, he killed the shopkeeper, too, right? Uh, no, I think shopkeeper. Uh, no, he did not. He, he bought that from him. No, no, the, the, the roly poly. Oh, uh, that's the other thing. Like, uh, sometimes enemies will act the shop. Oh, watch out. Boy, well done. Um, Sometimes enemies will wander up to the shopkeeper and get them angry. I've also noticed that when I have an angry shopkeeper, the music doesn't always turn on for every level, which is a little bit of a change. It's very mellow music. A lot of gold, though. Try bringing that with you and oh. see what happens. Oh, I've noticed the bats are a lot wonkier this Aww. time. Uh, I guess you can't bring it. Bummer. Uh, I've, yeah. I've been getting hit a lot more by bats this time around. I think it's just a little bit of difference in the way that I move. Chad asking why you keep picking up the cursed jar. It's worth a bunch of money. I don't know if it's worth it. Well, if you have to break it, the diamond in there is worth a lot. Uh, I, think but it also five, had... I think it's 5k for the diamond. Yeah, I guarantee you there's a lot of other weird stuff going on with that thing that I just haven't uh, figured out yet. What is that red thing there? It's a hover pack? Power pack. Power pack. I've, been, I've seen I, that a few times. I don't think I've been able to pick it up. Yeah, I'm not sure what it does. The shield's kind of neat. You know what you could do is pick up the shield and just run into the uh, shopkeeper. You'd be dead immediately. Wait, what does the shield do? Uh, you can run people into walls and kill them immediately. So just pick it up, and he won't be able to get out. Do, do I need to like hit the button to activate it or just run with it? No, just run into him. Okay. Got him. Oh, nice. <laughs> All right, but you got yourself so, a power pack now. That's the easier. Yeah, try the power pack and see what it does. So hit the journal entry. Check. Power pack abuse is where with improved weapon handling abilities. Get a shotgun and see what happens. Oh, boy. All right. Try the crossbow, too, because the crossbow only has one shot normally. Okay, oh, dude. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh you're what? Whipped on. Oh, wow. Holy wow. shit, man. That's neat. It's Simon Belmont over here. I'd go with a shotgun, man. Yeah. So the crossbow only fires once, and you have to go back and pick up the arrow to reload it, which is not my favorite mechanic. But the shotgun is—you uh, got a rapid-fire shotgun now, my friend. Right. If you whip, if you whip your rope with the fire stuff, will it? Uh, I think it's less kick too. Fire. Well, it's still some kick. That's neat. That's pretty cool. This is the run. Come on, Brad. Rory, would you say? Oh wow, does the shotgun go the whole length of the screen? It goes pretty far. Okay. Rory, would you say that? Um, the majority of your runs, you're just killing and stealing from the shopkeeper as opposed to buying things? Yep. Okay. I, I like to kill them, and I like to get a shotgun early. So the way I do it, I'm always, I don't think I've ever bought the Ankh uh, in the shopkeeper's uh, little hideout. I think I've always killed them for it. So it's, watch out. Yeah, watch out, watch out. You son of a, I hate those guys. You can get that, oh boy, watch out. Um, you could get the, it'd be two ropes to get to the, uh, um, damsel up there, the cat. Oh. But you st could still do it. It's right above you. It's right up that, uh, right directly above the door, that little passage up there. Oh. Yeah, sure. Gotta, I'm getting a pretty good loadout together here. Yeah, that's gonna hurt you on ropes, but you, you'll probably need life more than that because you're always going down. Alright, should I cut my losses? Yeah, don't worry about the turkeys. You could try killing him too if you want to. He does drop a shotgun, but uh, uh... probably not worth it. I mean, I would get his key. Uh, you don't have enough time anyway. Oh, am I going to shoot him? All right. Oh, oh, got him. <laughs> Hell yeah. You better hurry up for that treasure then. Oh, Turkey doesn't care. You killed my dad? Fine. He was oh, mean anyway. Hell? Yeah, you'll see some weird other stuff oh. uh, from time to time. I, oh boy, that was, that was an ouch. 
That was an ouchie. That sucks. Wow, that was not worth it at all. <sighs> uh, Richard Butt says, I'm Mitch. Oh, watch out. He's going to be aggro, but you can, you can, if you avoid him for now, he's going to cut. There we go. There we go. Okay. All right. And get what he's, get his, get his offer. Don't forget to shoot the package, too. Just take all the stuff. Yeah. Man, you're loaded. Shoot that. What is that? Is that the spray uh, spider web gun? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Boy, he's going to be a problem. You might want to put a bomb on top of him. Or you try going that way. Hmm. You can probably bomb down from over here and avoid him entirely if he's stuck in the uh, spider web. Yeah, he might have to do that. That's a big bomb. Wow. Oh, boy. Wow, that is a big bomb. I didn't realize it affect oh. bombs, too. Ooh. That kind of thing is dangerous because the math on bombs, like if you're trying to get to a certain thing, you kind of need to know how big it is. But I didn't realize I was going to make the bombs that much more powerful. That's neat. Power pack is serious. I've got a broken arrow for you, daddy. <laughs> it was like, okay, until you added the daddy in. I don't know <laughs> why we had to do that. Uh, so the uh, spitting snakes are red now. Uh, watch out for that just trap down there. You can drop the shotgun. Yeah, just I kind of hate to be without it. Oh, I mean, I have a climbing horse. Yeah. Yeah, do I? You got everything. Yeah, I do. Uh, hmm. oh you could just bomb through here if you want to, but... Yeah. yeah. Ooh. Big bomb. Wow. Oh, there's this trap down there. Watch out. I think it might have Did triggered you see, maybe. Did you see a pet? I haven't seen one. I haven't seen one. I haven't heard one yet. I hear I hear it now. There it is. Oh, it's, it's kind of in a weird spot. It's going to be tough to get to. You could really bomb the, the uh, trap if you really want to, but it might not be worth it. You got two Does health. it always get you a little bit of health? The yeah, it's, all, health. Oh, yep. it's always two health. You can walk up right down to the bottom of it and do, do a bomb there. Oh, but careful the bombs are big now. I don't know if that's going to hit the doggy. Oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> Tried my best. Oh, boy. Yep. <laughs> well, uh, should I try that key or should I just get out of here? Nah, I wouldn't worry about it. The Eye of Wajad is kind of not, uh, I mean, unless we, we know that the black market's there, I don't really know it. It probably is. I'm assuming the whole quest line is there, but. Oh. Um, you know, the, the one time I've found it super useful so far is the pickaxe new or is that old? Uh, Matic, yes, it's uh, it's uh, been in the first one too. Oh, it was okay. Can... Yeah, it's definitely worthwhile here because you are doing a lot more kind of, um, you know, it's a lot more. I feel like the levels are a little bit bigger, uh, so you have more kind of stuff you need to get through. Um, cuidado, Matt. Worst splunky item. Oh, that was my uh, I don't like the teleporter. Uh, I never um, use that. But I know a lot of people who oh. do. A young... I can't tell you. I'm not gonna try. Yeah, maybe try the boss this time. He's down the middle of the thing. You have to go back to the left. You don't. You don't have enough bombs to get a buy it anyway. So you don't have any bombs at all are there, right now. Are there things <laughs> hidden in those in those skeletons? Maybe. No, they're like just blockers. Secrets? You can whip whip through them, and uh, they just disappear. You got to go down the middle here. You want to take a look down first, but there he is over oh, there. He's yeah. Pretty oh. He'll take multiple shotgun hits, but um, what you probably want to do is wait for him to get to one side, then shoot him, and then climb up the ladder because he will roll up, roll out to one side and open a path to you. Okay. So this guy killed the giant porcupine. I think he, he did. Yeah. Careful, careful, careful. Yeah, keep going. Oh. Keep going. Uh, yeah. So All good. he didn't actually make the passage because he didn't let him roll. So, oh, I didn't uh, know that was a thing. <laughs> you can actually go to the left. It should be fine. Um, just bomb that wall over there. To the left? Yeah, to the left. Uh, either way. I mean, they both have passages down, I believe. This way? Yeah. It should only be one bomb, so it's not that big of a deal. Oh, maybe oh. it's... Two. Okay. Uh, what are your thoughts on the compass? I like the compass. I mean, it's really more for speedrunners than anybody else, but uh, it's mm -hmm. nice, especially on the cave levels, to the ice cave levels, to know where you're going. Um... It's not something I buy every time, but uh, I will definitely. It's always useful to have that information for you. Oh boy, this is a big one. I've noticed that the dark levels are a little bit brighter than they were in the first game, which is nice. Uh, I also haven't seen very many of them. I've only seen like one so far, but they are they are back. If you ate that, 
There's the X. <laughs> nice. <laughs> so that one way. goes to the that goes to the jungle. The other way will go to the volcano. Like I said, oh, uh, you're not gonna have an easy way to move that. So you might want to try. And, okay. Well, you will get a you will get an assistant over here too if you go this way. So there should be a some. Oh, uh, try the bombs. They you can, can push that box. All right. Yeah, you can get over there. Detach. Don't shoot it, though. Use your whip. Use your whip. You will kill them if you... That's just a regular guy. But be careful oh about this. Yeah. Tell your assistants. Oh. oh. You, you shot your own dude. You got the, you got the way. You can run down and just go. Yeah, run down and Ah, I don't think I have a bomb. Mm. I ran into the exact oh, same no. problem. Boo. Rats. Look at your journal entry for this, because I don't think I've ever killed one. Uh, too late. Uh, for... There's also a little map meet here now. Uh, if you haven't seen that before, there's a big bestiary, a lot of stuff uh, uncovered. Uh, go back to the map, maybe. I'm curious about that one. Uh, let me see if I can find that thing now that I'm here. Okay. Nope. Scarab nope. Golden Monkey. Ha. There it is. Rock Dog. Huh. Hence the name. You probably can't kill him with a whip, but I guess a shotgun works. Oh. So these little devil guys are from hell, uh, and now they're here. A lot of the, I mean, there are there are some reused. I have not figured out. Not every locked door has a key. Um, there are skeleton keys that'll open up any door, I believe. Oh boy, those things are oh, big I, and firing. I hate this already. Oh my goodness. I would go down myself. But, uh, check it and see. <laughs> That's probably the right call. It's got a shotgun. He does have a shotgun. It's true. Watch out. Oh, oh, my oh, God. oh yeah, that's the one. <laughs> uh, I didn't think it would come back a second time. Should have known better. Hmm. All right, careful, Brad. Well, I don't think there were any conveyor belts in the first game. That's oh my God. new. Yeah, there you go. That's bad news. You can fire, you can shoot him from a mop. Oh, you cannot shoot him from when you're dead. <laughs> That's good to know. It's good to know. Oh, a little slime, slime <laughs> is coming. Yeah, this is fun. Oh boy. Uh, there's definitely something you have to have a particular oh, well, want for the you know like the the demoralizing nature of this game. When yeah. you break through it you feel like you're king of the world when you actually make a lot of progress and that a good yama run is it uh, feels just amazing to do it is uh it takes hundreds of hours to get there i'm feeling a lot of people who really played a lot of spunky will fit right into spunky 2 pretty easily it's still going to be a lot of frustration for people new to it um but it's only 20 bucks i mean it's a really good price for a game that i've spent probably a thousand hours on at this point so whoa that's a I, lot of hours. I played on my Vita for just an insane amount of time. Uh, it was my, it's still my favorite playing game. Um, I really wish they'd put this on Spunky, but, or on Vita, but I'm sure it'll come to the Switch, which is fine. <laughs> the one thing I've noticed, and I would say in terms of bugs or anything like that, is that when you get a bunch of lava on a level, it can chug the frame rate down to like oh no. single digits. Poor dog. Yeah, he He's might got get it. out. Got it. Got it. They took away his butthole. You only see a tail now. Oh, that's wrong. Yeah, if, if the dog doesn't have the bottle, I mean, what are, what are we doing here? What's the point of the torch? Is it just a, a good weapon? Or? Yeah, just kind of can light stuff on fire. Oh, I don't awesome. think it's really much of a point to getting it, though, compared to what... I. Th this is one of the things that kind of confuses me. Like, there's not a huge amount of payoff for this little setup, unless there's something I'm missing to do with the torch elsewhere in the level. But, hey, it's fine. Set that guy on fire. Yeah, that's the thing about these spike traps. They're not spike traps anymore. They actually do push things away. So if you're standing next to one and it pushes like a stone at you, you can't get hurt. Oh, my torch, which is kind of interesting. You can go light it on those other torches, right? I don't know. That's a good question. Yeah, uh, I believe you can. There's probably some weird gnome thing, like get a torch all the way from one one to the end of the game, but be able to carry the dung beetle throughout the whole game. Yeah, that's kind of the going to be the fun thing about this is just finding all the secrets. I mean, I'm not. I'll probably look up some of the stuff at some point, but uh, for now, for the next couple of weeks, <clears throat> just play and, and see what's what's up. Uh, see what I can find out. I, I, the Yama stuff, like if you didn't know all that stuff beforehand, you would never figure out 
be very difficult to figure out the precise process of getting to Yama in the first game, but um, <clears throat> I'm sure there's a lot of stuff going on in this game that is below the surface. So, so it was beating Yama in the first game, was that the true, true, true ending, or is, is it something else? Yeah. yeah, it was the Olmec was the first boss. You had to kill Olmec in a certain way to get to Yama. Uh, you got a good... The only problem here is that the shield will probably cu crush the uh, jetpack too, but you might be able to... It's worth it. I mean, you can still get the shotgun for sure. Oh! Oh boy! What was that? I'm not quite sure what just happened there. I think I think the rocket pack blows up now. From what I just oh, saw. Okay. I think that blows up because I have definitely thrown a bomb on one that and it blew sense. up and I was really curious what caused that. I guess it's it. Okay, well, uh, mark, mark that one down, Ned. Uh, rocket pack blows up, <laughs> blows up now. And uh, you'll send out the letter. <laughs> <laughs> Dear merchant's uh, mother, your, your son was tragically killed in the line of duty. A lot was learned today. <laughs> like Cave Johnson. Uh, you want to check out co-op after this run? Sure, try it out. If it works, no guarantees. Uh, Jake the Snake Yass says, any thoughts on the PS5 stream Wednesday? We will be talking over that. Uh, 1 p.m. Pacific on Wednesday. Hopefully, we'll get some prices. Yeah, oh, right. They did that while uh, it all happened. I forgot. What do you get for sacrificing again? Uh, items for the most part. Uh, eventually, you get the um, blood skull, which lets you pick up oh. blood and get uh, life. Uh, and then I think if you keep on going long enough, like if you get four different damsels in Spucky One, you can. Oh, you can get a shop over there. Shop to your right. 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 Other way. No, no. Just getting the gold. Shit. Here. Did that. Yeah, I gotta use that. Did that shoot? Use, uh, shoot? Did the shoot? Uh, shoot? I believe, yeah, definitely did. It's, there's an arrow over there. Oh, yeah. Whoa, whoa. Don't like that. So you have another... Oh, this is a better one. Uh, you can definitely use a shield now to crush him, and then and you'll you, get a bunch of shit. You'll end it. Can you wear the jetpack? No, 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 get the power pack? No, just the shield, kill no, him. No, I know. And then I'm, you, just, I'm just looking around. You, oh, I don't think you can get them both at the same time, but try it out and see. Ah. There you go. Man, that's awesome. That's a good trick. I think you can only get one, but try I think they'll probably replace each other. Yeah, so you got the jetpack. This works as... There's also a hover pack now, which only lets you hover and not fly up. Um, oh. Yeah, so I think. You can I don't only know. Get what one. are you thinking? Jet pack is, jet pack is too very good. much the the way to go here. Oh boy, be careful with bombs around Yam, uh, Yang too. He does uh, does not like bombs near him, just like a shopkeeper. Yeah, th these guys are really not easy to get up ladders and ropes and stuff. There you go. Oh yeah, that kickback. <laughs> um, yeah, now, I'm, now I'm missing that power pack. Mm. Barker Sorry. is on fire. Wants to know how do I stop myself from trying to rush levels? Uh, you don't. It's uh, the more time here now. There's three minutes instead of two and a half. Um, I, I think you're probably going to be a little bit more leisurely. I think there's a lot more stuff you can kind of ignore, like the turkey stuff doesn't really seem to be worth the. Um, time to do it as far as i can tell i'm sure there's more i'm sure there's some reward for doing every yang quest in the game but uh at the first off i just go take your time it's not that bad and the ghost is not a uh, death oh boy you can shoot him from over here though Wait. you can definitely shoot that dude just shoot him from there shoot now no no shoot him again there you go oh you got it hell yeah man now i see how murderous this game is is there anything special for getting through spelunky without murdering the shopkeeper I don't think in so. In the original one? Uh, I don't believe so. I, I kill them all the time. They're, I mean, all the stuff is so expensive that unless you're really focusing on gold, you probably won't uh, be able to afford like the jetpack. So once you know the, the few tricks, like we've already, that shield one is really good. Uh, that's new to this game. You know, they never sold shields. There was a shield in the first game, but it was never sold. It was only in a, a secret. Now watch out. Oh, yeah, don't throw those things. Yes, they can. Be careful. Just throw them away. Um, I always, I'm a, I'm a shopkeeper killer. Uh, you better be careful how much you show that shield thing. They're going to nerf it. There, The key is there in the entrance to the key place is right to the left. You don't need your shotgun. Just drop it here. And that's where you want to go to turn the key in. 
Um, that'll give you the Eye of Wedjat, or Utjat Eye, I think it's called this time. It's through that door there. So you got a good good layout here. What's with the shopkeeper in the little stone prison? Those were vaults in the first game, um, and they used to have a lot of gold in them. I don't know, because it seems like here they're just, they don't have any treasure chests in there, so I'm not sure if there's something different or new going on, but... Uh, oh boy, he's mad. You can shoot him from far away, so don't worry. Just get down there quick and start shooting. There you go. Shoot, shoot, shoot. There you go. Shoot, shoot, shoot. So yeah, bullets will travel as far as they want to go, so. Don't miss a pit? Yeah. Uh, probably. You already have three health, though. You probably don't need it. You can try to find it if you want to. Real fast. Not been over here already. Oh, that's the thing. So, is there a reason the icon next to 1 3 is bouncing? That means that the uh, uh, shopkeepers are mad at you. I think they replaced the music for that with uh, uh, the icon there. So if you look over there, you can see the icon bouncing. Shopkeeper is Yeah, back. I kind of missed the music. I know. It was a little omnipresent, but um, the way I play this game. But it lets you, it lets you know, right? It lets yeah. you know that uh, something went wrong. That's an optional uh, uh, thing in the... Um, it's an optional thing in the, in the settings. You can... The, oh, all these the shopkeeper music? Yeah, you can. Uh, no, the the icon. Um, oh, oh my boy. god! Oh, oh. I was trying to use. <laughs> fuck me! I was trying to use the jetpack and it didn't turn on. Oh, so you're gonna have an easier time killing the dude now. Uh, like I said, uh, you're right above the cool bore. Just get down next to him, hit him once, and then jump over him, or just use your jetpack because he will roll you. And that's how you're supposed to get to the exit of the cell. He keeps it alive though. Keep shooting him. Yeah. There. And you get a little health back too. All right then. Nice. Well done. Yeah, well and you done. should have a bomb to give to the shortcut lady. There are enemies in here, so don't go too fast, uh, but not very many of them. Those are worth gold to pick up. They're not enemies. There's a pet. I love that kitty cat. Oh, oh, she's still alive. You're gonna be right up near the exit anyway, so uh, well, watch out for that guy. Oh, oh. oh my god! No bread. Oh no! <laughs> Alright, you wanna try some co-op? Shit, I did not think he was gonna activate that fast. Yep. Man, you can try another run if you want to no, before. No, 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 no. Let's uh, let's. Uh... Oh, he's just playing with you. Yeah. Find each other. No oh, guarantees that's will actually work, but um, oh, I have to update the application. So, do it. Installing update file. Now it's version 1.05. Um, play with physics on these charms. You might actually hmm. need to update too. Uh, I, I, got, I got that one before I booted up. Okay. Ooh. I don't know here much. Hmm. Who's the top player? I don't know. Good uh, triangle. Yeah, I am. That just takes it to the top. SPM rules. Wait, that's okay. the top player? What What about that's the top? Yeah, I'm not clear. This is, uh, I don't think anybody's good enough to get very far in this game yet. Um, oh, is it just the score? These are the daily runs, I think. And there's oh, only 30 people oh, playing right now, so. Oh, oh. Yeah. oh, fuck. I don't have PlayStation Plus to play this oh, online. No. Shit, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, so, no. you, so you can't? I don't. It's, it pops up in a big ad for PlayStation Plus. I never turn on. Uh, I can try to make a monthly payment real quick. Let me see if I can do that. I'm just going to hit search. I bet nobody's playing. <laughs> You're just going to sign up real fast. I'm going to try to. I've had a subscription before. The problem is Sony's credit card form always gets my address wrong. Like it says it's the wrong address. Um, if you want to play another single player run or two, let me see if I can get this okay. set up real quick. Let proceed to check out. Let me see how long this takes. Oh, I guess Far I could do the daily. Try the daily. Yeah, do the what daily. Do you say? Okay, I'm I'm actually up now. Go do the daily real quick, and we'll oh. try to uh, we'll try to do it after that. Choose your adventure. Again, if anybody has any questions that you think I might be able to answer, not very far along in the game, I don't think any of us are, but use the ask a question button at the top of your chat to uh, let us know. We'll be talking about this game more over the coming weeks, I guarantee that much. I don't think we're going to do like daily streams like Patrick will be, uh, but I definitely want to do more streams of this going forward as I learn more about it. Oh my god. Oh, your, your hearts are purple now. To let you know that you're in the daily. 
I think it's because I'm using the purple character. Oh, maybe. You might be right. Mm. Well, you made it out even, at least. Yeah. So you're looking for you're looking for score here, right? Yeah, it's yeah, gold. Is, is it just gold? Uh, yeah, it's just gold. Uh, at least the way it was in the first game. And that means you can't really spend a lot of it if you want to get really high on the leaderboards. But honestly, the leaderboards for this the first game are just so insane. Like people are getting millions of gold. Oh boy, yeah, be careful! You can't climb up on those uh, platforms. You have to jump. You have to land on them fully. This is kind of mean. Mm. So I have to rope or bomb down. Does a bomb break two squares, two tiles? Uh, should yes. Um, but I, like I said, I've noticed some oddities. Oh, there's a skull. At, I think there was a skull. You could have picked up. Skull, right? In the in the spike pit, is that not a skull you can pick up? Oh, it was, yeah. No, I think that's part of the. Oh, oh no, it's it's decoration. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Okay. Boo. Oh, no. oh man, this is a long drop. Oh, you can drop down the box. Like I was gonna... No, you can, you can no, just but... push up to the left wall and then you'll grab onto the. No, uh, no, no, ledge I know, there. but that guy's gonna pop out of the dirt the second yeah. I'm in there. <laughs> I don't know if I can drop. They, they can't go through wood, so. And just drop, drop. Yep. Okay. There you go. No, no, no. Okay. Yeah, these turkeys are. Mine I haven't found a lot to be worthwhile on them, but uh, like I said, I'm sure there's Come some. Come on, what are you talking about? Reports. <laughs> What's about the leg? Right. My college mascot was a turkey, so. Oh, get out of here! Fuck. Oh. Okay. Oh. Ooh. It took the damage, not you, so you're fine. Yes. Now, can you put a turkey on a turkey? <gasps> John Madden Summer is furiously masturbating. Yes. <laughs> Probably. So but not because of what you said. So if I <laughs> just, just in general. Uh, you can you can't afford the bombs, uh, and you can't really. It's going to be tougher to get him aggroed and safely killed without. If I if I spend money, uh, does that detract from my score, or is it total? Yeah, yeah. it yeah. does. I believe. I'm pretty sure. Can you can you can you just have that guy go roly poly and have him have him fight? Uh, the shopkeeper would probably kill him without uh, really mm. doing too much. But mm. I'm really curious how how the vehicle system works a little bit later. Oh boy, you're still you still have oh there there goes. I was like you still haven't taken damage, but eh. there goes your friend. Eep. Ooh boy. Ooh. <laughs> Look up here. There might be a. It's probably below. Okay, now you're you still haven't seen the door yet that you need to get the wedge jet. Ooch, ooch, oh, jet eye. Worth a lot of money. Oh right, I figure you're still in your daily. It's only worth I think five or eight thousand here. I think the ones in the second world are worth a lot more. Oh boy. Look at that guy. Oh, oh man, those guys are assholes. Uh, that's a... Shit. Hey, you got a lot going on. Yeah. Oh my god. I hate those they really, things. They really are. They just can come at you from anywhere. You can get a helper if you want. Oh, look at this. Here he goes. Here he goes. Uh huh. Shit. Oh, watch out. Oh god, Did, go back over there and see what happened, because I, okay, he, I think he vanished, that's good. He didn't aggro uh -oh. the shopkeeper. You can throw the key at the other dude and kill him. Which you can just angle it down. The uh, one's trapped in the spider web, he's still alive. All right, he's still, definitely still alive. There we go. Did you see the yeah. key room? Did not. You might not want to worry about it. It's not going to be an immediate kind of uh, reward. It'll let you see more things in the level, but beyond yeah, that, it's not. Right. Oh. Have I played La Mulana? I have not. I've seen a lot of those games. Uh, they always looked really interesting, but I haven't really played very much of them. The game that I feel that this game is oddly similar to is like a lot of Steam World Dig, like in the way that uh, sure. you move. Like it feels more explicit. The games are always pretty similar, um, but it's it's I see more of that kind of influence in this 
this time around. So you're gonna have a real tough time with this boss without any shotgun. You can still make him aggro you and then he'll roll. Hmm. And you can probably wait for him to, to leave. Oh, do I not have to kill him? Uh, he just need to get him through the wall to get to the watch out. Here he goes, there we go. So just wait a little bit, he'll probably come back or maybe you can lure him to hit you again and there we go. Whoa, whoa, just whoa. yeah, just run to the right now and, and avoid him. Yeah, yeah, the other way. Just get to get to the exit. He's, you're gonna have a terrible time trying to kill him with a without a shotgun or anything. Shit. No, you don't have to do it. There's a oh, door up here. Totally didn't notice it. Oh well. The doors can be a little hard to see. I find. Oh boy, that's a tough game. All right. You can get some gold here at least. Mm. Wow. Wow. Only worth yeah, a thousand. Nice. In the first game, they were worth five, I think, and that was uh, nice and a lot. So you're doing okay. Oh, look at the snails hiding from me. I think the world, the leader was only like twenty grand. So uh, you're I think the there. top guy was like forty, but oh, okay. Okay. yeah, forty next was guy, number next, one. Next guy was like twenty something. <clears throat> All right, come on, Brad. You're saying I'm gonna place. I'm told that this is going live at eleven o'clock Eastern tomorrow by somebody in chat. So oh. tomorrow morning. Okay. Whoa, what is that? A robot. Uh, okay, uh, it's a robot. You, I think the spikes on the front will hurt you, but you can jump on his head to make him blow up. Wait, is it's it gonna an be enemy? Tough. Huh? That's an enemy? Yeah, it's, not an enemy. A, it's not a thing to ride? Okay. No, no. Try hitting him and see if he, or try jumping in front of him first, but yeah, you're gonna have to get on top of him, I think. Or you can keep hitting him, maybe. He might fall in. Uh, oh, watch out, watch out. Yeah, oh, okay, he does hurt you. Jump on top of him and Ooh. he will. Um, yeah, you're gonna have to use a rope here, I think. Jump, yeah. Yeah, jump on top and he will blow up eventually. Oh. He's a, he's a moving bomb. Just don't be near him when he blows up. Huh. Okay. But you should try and get this. Oh, you already did. You already saw the lava stuff. Um, the lava physics are really interesting. Oh, if it wasn't my daily, I would, but. Yeah. Got leaderboards to think about. Those uh, platforms over there will fall uh, after you stand on them for a bit, so be careful. You're, you can fall down on one and jump before it hits the ground and not get hurt. Oh, yeah. That's how physics work. Yeah. <laughs> Be careful, though. Jump. There you go. Uh, that dude has some stuff. You can oh, use yeah, a freeze, gun, freeze gun on him and kill him and get the bombs. And then that's the easiest way to do it. Well, don't walk out of the store, though. Just walk back a little bit. Ooh. Or he has to get out from under that little alcove oh. so you can actually jump on him. I see. So just... Pick it up, walk like two blocks to your right, and then turn around and fire on him, and you should be able to immediately kill him. Oh, that's going to hit my score, though, right? No, you won't be spending any money. No, just kneel down and pick it up like any other item. Yeah, don't buy it. Okay. Wait, do you think I'm far enough over that I can just pick it up and do it? Probably. He'll walk towards you. Just let him get out from under the alcove. Um, nope, wrong item. Wrong item! Ooh! <laughs> <laughs> well, he's not aggroed yet. You can still pick up the freeze ray if you want to try it. Uh, you weren't perfectly on it, I think. <laughs> it was a little too far to the right. Walk over and see where the freeze ray is. Uh, make sure you're on top of the freeze ray. So if I more. pick up a thing and then just drop it, he won't aggro? No, he shouldn't. As long as you don't can, walk out of the store. I don't know if I can get so you it. Can pick, pick up the camera and move it over. <gasps> there you go. You got it now. Just yeah, but don't. You gotta go. Ooh. Um, there, there we go. Perfect. Oh. Jump on him, jump on him, jump on him, jump on him. Oh there. my god. Excellent. Brad, you've taken your first step. Oh my god. <laughs> Never a doubt in my mind. What does the camera get to? Uh, this is a really weird Ooh. one. I haven't, it, it'll stun some enemies. Uh, and mm. I, I honestly, it might be the most useless one to me. I'm sure there, I think there's like weird stuff you need to do with it, but I've never really used it very much. So. What if it's there like take a picture of every enemy? Um, God, I, I, I don't play. I already don't oh, play no. Pokemon. Those guys ride turkeys too. Yeah, they can do a lot of weird shit. Should I? You're gonna, you're gonna have to burn a rope here, no matter what. You have a lot of bombs that you can yeah, bomb through. Yeah, I suppose. Thank you. Go. Time for that spiky ball. Oh, oh, oh the, the icon turned red for the uh, ghost here, so you got to really start cranking it. You got to start cranking it, my friends, if you know what I mean. Uh, Is that the door? Oh, but, oh, oh, shit! I jumped under it for a second, and it didn't move, and I was like, well, I guess that one doesn't activate, and then... Oh, man. Okay, well... Hey, 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 that's like second place, man. Is it? I am number two. Yeah! I am number two. <laughs> Take a screenshot. Oops. Mm-hmm. Oh. 
There we go. Okay. Alright. Let's do the thing. Uh, the Locust Horde wants to know if you can only buy one of these games, which would you play? I mean, you might as well with Spunky 2. Um, I don't think there's any reason to... If you can only play one of them. Uh, I'm online now. Let me see if I can press invites. I, I have it. invite. Okay, how do I That's accept that? should be in your notifications. Oh, All right, I'm going to be off to the side now because I'm looking at my TV. All right. So, All right. Uh, apologies if I'm not perfectly framed in my in my um, ready. Let's try this out and see. I might actually get out of frame a little bit because um, I need to see the whole screen. Sorry if the audio gets weird for anybody here. Oh, boy, this is chunky. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Very <laughs> a little stuttery. The, the netcode might require some work Ooh. here. Possible. Uh, could, be, could be somebody's the... connection. I'm. Uh, I mean, I'm on like gigabit Wi-Fi to my PS4. Oh, but, is your PS4 uh, on Wi-Fi? That's. It's on Wi-Fi. PS4 Wi-Fi is not very good. Everybody is on Wi-Fi, Brad. We're on a cable. Treat I don't know like if Wi-Fi. I don't know if Wi-Fi would be this though. Yeah, it's like 400 up and down. Oh, definitely. Yeah, but if there's enough packet loss, it would definitely cause this sort of thing. But. Uh, it, no, it has to be something be my bad. Folks, but, but, yeah, I don't know, but this is unplayable for sure. Uh, yeah. <laughs> hey. <laughs> All right. Well, wow. Oh, well, I'm dead. <laughs> now you're a ghost. Go get your stuff. Do you still blow? Can you still blow on people? You can, I believe. Yeah. Woo! Bye, my kitty. I blew the kitty. Oh, this is tough. This is wild. Wait, I'm sorry. Is this it? What do you mean? Oh, I don't know. I don't want to sound rude or anything, but is, it, is this going to launch like this? I it could another... be one of our connections. It's hard to say. I haven't, I haven't, I haven't watched any yeah, other streams. I, I would not blame this entirely on the game. Okay. Without, without further testing, by any means. There have been already two patches for this game today. Oh, a network error occurred. Okay. Okay. Well, yeah, yeah. They've they've updated this game like three times since Friday. I mean. Yeah, there's no way to say for sure if that's final net code or not. Do you want to try uh, the arena mode or something? Like, um, is there a way to get into the multiplayer stuff from here? Wait, play I'm not arena. Sure it's on play. It's on the play uh, thing. Deathmatch oh. casual. Let's just go ahead and see here. Okay. Wow, there's a lot of options here. Hmm. I'm gonna try to invite you. Uh, or do I have to? I don't see a way to invite anybody from here. You can go and play the single player probably. Just try this out and see if it, how it works. Um, start with bots, yeah. Bots. Okay. Huh. Oh, weird. This is a team thing. Oh yeah, she's teams. Mm. Yes. Woo! Oh, that's neat. That's pretty good. Huh? That's neat. Oh. But not but not multiplayer. Uh, this is bots right now. I wasn't. I didn't see an option to start this with anybody online, but um, oh boy, oh. that's a big guy, doesn't it? Wait, what just happened? That Somebody pulled me down off the ladder. Leave me alone! Oh, you can grab people. Is that, is that new? Well, you can always pick up people. Um, I don't know about grabbing. Those are aggressive bots. Yeah, that's rough. Yeah. I mean, they, the AI, I'm sure this is pretty closely related to the AI and the... Uh, oh my god, weird. I can't move. <laughs> this is great. Wow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Nobody wins. I wonder if you'll get any boss spoilers in here if uh, they just show all the levels. I won. That's a good... Apparently. I don't know if they're going to show some environments that I haven't gotten to yet. Um, or I wonder maybe they only pick what the host has gotten up to. Oh. Pound it there, buddy. I appreciate the custom ghosts. It's a nice touch. <laughs> I'm back in life. No, 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 no. Okay. This is moving really fast. Wow. Nice, I like that good strap. Hang out on my ledge up here. Oh, 
Oh! Oh boy! Oh! Oh! He threw a the corpse at you. That's uh, pretty bold. You got, him, you got him! You got him! Very. Oh, oh, nice. oh man! Wait. Press X to revive. I'm not sure what it does, but. Oh, oh boy! Oh. You got 12 bombs. He's got three. Oh shit! Do we have a shotgun? Nope. These guys are really oh, hardcore. Go, 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 go. There's a, there's a box over to your left. A, a box. Nope, not anymore. Uh, boy. I know, he's, he's savage. Very serious. Uh, yeah, I wonder if they're only showing stuff that you got up to, because it's only been the same two levels back and forth, right? Shit. Yeah. <laughs> that one. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Oh, this is, uh, this is different. Is good. Oh. <laughs> A lot going. These bots are way too good. <laughs> I. Well, why are there oh. sometimes two of you on the screen? I'm not 100% sure about that. Okay, but you are seeing that as well, yeah. right? Okay. Get ready. Hey! Oh boy! Oh! Uh, oh! Nicely done. This is it? This is your chance. Oh, shit. Man, he threw a rope. Oh man! He revived and threw a rope at you from below. That guy's such that a dick. Uh, he's dancing. What do you think? Best of five? Is that what they're going? Yeah, I think it's best of five or first two five. Wow, that's a big map. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get him! Get him! Oh, that would hurt. Give me that. Is that parachute? Oh, man. Oh, oh he's got... Oh, these bots oh, are so got good. got a corpse. Oh yeah, you're in a good spot. I like this. Oh no! Oh, oh Brad! Wow. Whoa! I'm wow. gonna I'm gonna give you the credit you deserve for that. <laughs> Thank you. That was Snap very decision. cool. Ooh. Very cool. Wow. Ooh. Good for you. Thank you. That was great. It's real sweaty in here. Ah, oh shit! What happened wow. there? Oh, oh, he blew the wall. <laughs> <laughs> Where am I? Oh shit. Oh. Man. Just got one more round to try to find a winner here. <laughs> this poor llama's not doing too well. Wait, isn't that a sloth? Uh, yeah, it must be sloth. Sorry. I get my animals mixed up a lot. I get it. Yeah. Oh shit! One on one! Oh no! Oh, don't let this guy win. Oh no. As long as he doesn't win, you'll be okay. There's a chance. Yeah. Oh shit. Oh. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. That was it. That was an exciting thing to watch. I feel like I would just watch that with all bots and just see what happens. Sure. Somebody fire up salty butt. <laughs> uh, so there's no way to get into that in in multiplayer, huh? Um, I think so. You mean like online? Or maybe yeah. arena, maybe arena is just local actually. I wonder if it would be local multiplayer. I think that might be. I guess it had to be, right? Yeah, the, the four doors there. Yeah. Yeah, because it's not under online, so. 
guess online is just co-op then? Hmm. It's really weird. Yeah. The UI seems a little bit odd about this. Yeah. I wouldn't I wouldn't write off that multiplayer until the game's actually out. Sure. Since yeah, I know. If, no, no, no. Yeah, it's um it me, just seemed real real rough. Do you yeah. want to try um joining Matt's game and see if there's uh, um see if he I, hosts it? Let me try to how do I invite you here. Shoot me an invite real fast. I'm getting back out here. Online. Um, how do I? So I search for people. No, go to. There should be like a triangle Press invite or something like that. Okay, yeah. Let me try this real quick. Okay, invites. All right, I sent you an invite. Okay. Okay. Ready. Ready. This seems, looks, seems better. This looks fine for me, but you're warping around a lot. Yeah, it's, yeah. Not, it's not perfect for me either. Oh, geez. Wow, you are just... Yeah, this is a, <laughs> a little bit better, but uh, not really playable. Yeah. My. <laughs> I mean... Yeah. Oh. Yeah, definitely not playable. Totally the connection's fault. <laughs> I don't know. I mean... I know a lot of people who still use the Wi-Fi on their PS4 for multiplayer games, and it, it it might not be the best, but it does work. Oh, I, I just mean I mean totally not my fault. Oh, oh, right. Oh, did you yeah, did you fault. manually yeah. exit out, or did it just? I did. Okay, got to the end. All right. Um, it always uh, pulls in the per oh, and network error. Yeah, okay. yeah. Well, that, this seems like it might not be ready yet. Hopefully, that'll clear up in the next few hours before the game goes live. He did say netcode was the thing he was working on hard for the ah, end of the game, so okay. uh, the end of development. So maybe it still is is a little bit wonky yeah, right now. They could they could have more changes to push out, but uh, this game seems pretty good so far. Yeah, yeah, thinks? I wanna, yeah, yeah, I wanna spend a little time. I wasn't a big spelunky person, but um, maybe this one. I mean, I guess if I wasn't a big spelunky person, this is probably not going to do it for me. It seems. It's definitely more of that. It seems a lot like Spelunky, but yes, you know, I it's like good. video games. I I enjoy too. Uh, I, I'm looking forward to playing more. I got, I got um, good news for you. This is a video game. Yeah, and uh, really, I'm on board. Yeah, I'm looking forward to the Steam version. I'll probably switch over to that when it comes out. I really hope they do come to Switch at some point. Um, that'll be the that'll definitely be the place to go. Yes. Uh, I guess that's gonna do it oh. then. Thanks, Brad. Thanks for yes. having me. I, I could probably just sit here yeah. and do runs all day, but I should probably call it there. Sorry, Dung Beetle. Uh, yeah, this is out. Ooh, that's uh, this is out in what? The morning hours. Yeah. I'm told tomorrow morning for most of the uh, Americas. About, about 18 hours, something like that. Seems like. I don't know that for sure. That's just what I was told in chat. It might be, might be earlier or later. According to chat, 20 yeah. bucks. Yeah, it is 20 bucks for sure. PlayStation Quad. Oh, sorry. I'm just trying right. to think of things. Oh to no, say. you're just gonna do this run. It's so okay. I no, I understand. Play. Yeah. <laughs> you should probably stop. All yeah. right. Thanks everybody. No, for do the run. Go ahead. Wait, you, sure? you can't stop mid run. Yeah, sure. go for it. All right. Yeah, go. I guess I got I got halfway down one one. That's about to count. Oh, we got we're gonna stop with the suspended note. You doing a run? Are you out of your mind? That's fair. I like the way you think. Let's see, look at that. We'll never know if you, you could have. You can beat the whole game on this one. Mm. Oh, that's gonna be a tough. That's gonna be a tough shopkeeper to get though. The yeah, the other strategy sometimes is to put up a rope outside the thing and try to angle a bomb in there, but uh, that is uh, not really worth the effort. Wait, does guy. he not? Does he not aggro as soon as he sees he, the bomb? Uh, you can be outside the shop and throw it in, and he'll run out oh. and uh, either blow him up or he'll run out and fall oh, down. Careful, it's go pretty, for it. It's this is not the best setup for it though, with the way things are. There'll be more shopkeepers. Oh! Whoa! Well, I like it. Saucy. I didn't know you could do that. I'm not sure what I just did there. Oh boy! No, no, no! Yeah, take that gopher. Oh no. Nice. It's a pro strap. Hmm. 
No thanks. Yeah, tricky things still uh, yet to be determined the risk reward there. It's a lot of time. It's not super difficult, except when you uh, start taming the turkeys, it can take, it can really ruin you if you get uh, moved too far off and run into something. Um, but so far the rewards I have seen have not been worth the effort. Uh, I think Man, he, does show up, he does show up as a shopkeeper of turkeys later on in like world two if you i think maybe if you do that he will show up but i'm not sure if that's tied wait wait one. brad put put that guy on the altar wait does that work yeah it will if he's but he's hard to keep uh oh, i thought it had dead. to be uh oh, well. it can be, oh. it can be <laughs> almost anything. as long as you can stun it, it it can be it can be almost anything. Oh, i thought it had to be a pet or damsel or nope oh, it can be a shopkeeper shopkeepers are worth about half as much as damsels uh, everything else is worth a lot less than either of those, but uh, obviously shopkeepers are really tough to get there unless it's their body. Oh, that's good to know. Uh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Oh, no. Uh, get you every fair. time. Nope. Wait, uh, Ooh. All right. Well, clearly, uh, I passed my peak here. <laughs> Very audacious, this title screen, I think. It's good. Yeah. Oh, it's good audacious. Stuff. All right, thank you guys for joining me. This game's pretty good. Thank you for joining me too. Pretty good. Brad. Yeah, thank you, Brad. Splunky 2 coming to a PlayStation 4 near you pretty soon. PC a little bit after that. We'll probably be back with more on this game soon. Uh, thanks, everybody, for watching. Thanks, Brad.